From the main RTC window, there's another sub-window you can select. I call it the hot buttons. RTC program supports up to 100 hot buttons, which you can define to do practically every function of the remote by just pressing a single button. For example, I take button number one, and if I right click on it, hot button edit window comes up, and here's the button label, and I can, for example, say startup engine 15, select the hot button command as say extended startup, set the TIU number as necessary, set the engine or lash up number as necessary, and press the OK button. That button becomes a startup engine 15 button. I can now right click on button 2, and let's just say that that's going to be whistle engine 15 select whistle on command TIU1 engine 15 press OK so for example now I can press this button startup engine 15 and actually I set it for the extended startup so it's going to play the extended startup sequence Again, I'm not sure if you can hear that. I may have turned the volume down too much. Of course, I could fix that. I could program button 3 to do something like set engine 15 volume to 90%. select the hot button, scroll down until I find the volume controls for master volume, engine TIU, and we're going to set the volume to 90. Press OK. Now here's that command. If I press on that, now I think you probably can hear it. It's gotten just a, a bit louder as the engine volume went up to 15. If I wanted to blow the whistle. Oh, and of course, that's just a whistle on command. Okay, how's that for a, a save? So I, I had just forgotten that the whistle on just did that, turned the whistle on. Whistle off just does that, turns the whistle off. You can look at all of the, the hot buttons by pressing the button with the right arrow on it. And you can see here are our 100 buttons. You can program all of these to do all of the functions available and can do it for any TIU number, any engine number.